I still doubt that this iron phosphate battery cells can reach 10,000 cycle times or not. It means you can use the battery cells for 27 hmm. years if you charge the battery cells once per day. Hello guys, this is Leah. Welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I would like to talk about the topic about the life cycle of lithium battery cells and what we can do to try our best to maintain your life cycles of your battery cells. Now the lithium ion phosphate battery cells on the market, which is different as the MNC cells. The MNC cells, the life cycle, the max can up to 2000 life cycle to 3500 life cycles. 50 mph were almost uh, 1,500 to 2,000 and the 100 mph to 230 mph life cycle is uh, 4,000 to 5,000 cycles. 280 mph above the life cycles is uh, 6,000 to 12,000 life cycles. But we still doubt about these battery cells life cycles. For example, the 12,000 life cycles, if you buy these battery cells, you can use even 32 years and you also can leave these battery cells to your grandchildren. So this is a joke on the, on the battery cells market. And also I saw some advertisement about the battery pack. They sell the 51.2 voltage, 100 mph, 5 kilowatts hour a battery pack. The life cycle have uh, 8,000 life cycles. This is impossible for only 5 kilowatts hour and the uh, e and the uh, 100 mph battery cells. Like the most important, uh, like the EVE brand. For example, they launched two types about the 100 mph. One is uh, 5,000 cycle times with the black pad on the top of the battery cells. Another is uh, only 2,000 cycle times with the white pad on top of the battery cells. This is totally different to battery cells of 100 mph cells. According to my Germany friend who used the household basic electricity, they need to maintain the whole daily life they use the coffee machine and air conditioner and heaters and the routers extra for for uh, provide the whole solar 24 hours. The total load they use need at least 260 watts. It means it's about six kilowatts hour to nine kilowatts hour per day. If if they buy the 5 kilowatts hour battery pack, they need to charge once or twice per day. So it is also necessary to consider the deep discharge of 80% to 90% and the available power for this battery pack only maybe 4 kilowatts hour. At least it is less than 5 kilowatts hour. So it is, can't be too used so large long time. So they have some interesting in my daily work. Uh, they have some uh, customers often will send me some barging sales they, they did before the project. Which is also the trouble for most of customers and friends. When they do the battery solar system, the battery will like pregnant will to barge uh, when the uh, system working. The battery swelling will definitely infect the battery life cycles. As we to see the data sheet, what is the uh, life cycle explanation of the cell? The life cycle test methods, 10,000 cycle times under the room temperature. The battery cells covered with uh, the 50 mm aluminum plate and the fixture force is 3,000 and tested in a high and low temperature chamber, charged to 3.65 voltage with a constant power of 0.508, rest for 
30 minutes discharge to 2.5 voltage by 0.5 series and then rest for 30 minutes and repeat the above standard charge and discharge until the capacity phase to 70% of the nominal capacity. So when we made the battery solar system about the CST series, the first thing we need to pay attention is to compress the system pieces battery cells and secondly use the 0.5C rate under the room temperature 25 degrees. Uh, which is a uh, charge and discharge rate of uh, 114 MPa. First, we need to make sure that the voltage difference of your system batteries is not too big and the capacity uh, voltage um, is more better to under the same data. Only after meeting these most basic charging conditions so that uh, we can make sure to try our best to maintain your battery cells life cycles. But in fact, this all the problems the BMS, battery managed system, can meet this problem. The battery managed system can help you to balance the, all the cells and uh, disconnect the batteries when the high or cold temperature so will disconnect if you overcharge and over discharge pay attention even you have the bms if you don't attention these things you will also lose your battery capacity because uh and i have some uh, i have some customer they uh, buy the batteries back and the, they don't want to use, so they leave the battery cells on the garbage and in the warehouse, and, and then they lose all the battery capacity. The battery will do the self-discharge when you don't use it. Their self-discharge drops from 10% to 0%, even below 0%, the batteries already die. So, when you don't uh, uh, use your battery cells, we most re recommend you stay the battery storage, keep 30% to 50%. And you need to charge your battery cells from few months. Okay, hope this video will help you guys a lot. If you have any interesting stories of your barging cells, you can leave the message on my comment so see you guys see you in the next video bye bye